Hello everyone, welcome to emergency radiology case review series. This is an infant patient who presented to emergency department with inconsolable crying and bulging fontanelles. Patient underwent CT head examination. I'm going to scroll through the axial images. As you can clearly see, the ventricles are markedly dilated. There is an hyperdense lobulated mass in the atrium of the left lateral ventricle, there is periventricular hypodensity consistent with transepentymal CSF flow and edema. Patient subsequently underwent MR examination. MR angiogram demonstrated hypertrophied anterior choroidal artery supplying the left lateral ventricular mass. Following administration of intravenous contrast, there is avid enhancement of the left lateral ventricular mass which demonstrated frond-like projections. Patient underwent catheter angiogram as part of pre-surgical treatment. On the catheter angiogram, you can clearly see hypertrophied choroidal artery, which is supplying the left lateral ventricular mass. You can see avid intratumoral vascularity within the left lateral ventricular mass. Constellation of findings is consistent with choroid plexus papilloma, which in pediatric patients is commonly seen in the lateral ventricle more so on the left lateral ventricle than on the right lateral ventricle. In adult patients, choroid plexus papilloma is commonly seen in the fourth ventricle. I hope you found this case to be interesting and informative. Thanks for your attention.